Yeah, it'll definitely have a huge effect on them. It'll affect each guy a little differently depending on what their makeup is. But, you know, we, I mean, we're meeting, we're over meeting. I mean, where everyone's, we don't have a lot to do. I can't go to a restaurant, I can't go anywhere. Our physician coaches are the same thing. I mean, and rookies were allowed to meet with more than just eight to 12. So um, those guys have gotten more meeting hours than, um, than are possible. I mean, they, you only can get so much, but it gets to a certain time where, yeah, they can almost coach the route because that's what we're doing. But then they got to go apply it on the field. We need to see them do that. We need to film it. We need to come back in, watch how it moved. Like, all right, you're, I'm articulating this way, but obviously you're running it this way, so you're hearing it different. And then you got that, that's just coaching, and that's what's working through. And our rookies don't get any of that, so they might think they have it, and they're going to get to camp, and they're not even close. And the the problem is, you usually work that stuff out in OTAs and stuff, and then the rookies get away for 40 days, and they have a chance when they come back to training camp to make the team. Where I'm so worried about guys now is how do you make the team? in training camp um, when you're on the bubble and it's going to take you three weeks to figure it out. Well, you only have one week left to now earn it. And, and so those are the guys that worry about a lot more, but this is, I mean, this is how it used to be with quarters, the quarter system. I mean, we didn't get Solomon and Kendrick Bourne our first year until training camp. They were allowed to come to a mini camp. So they got two days of practice, but that was it. Um, it always sets guys back. And then some guys um, just the way they think, the way they learn, the way they work doesn't affect at all. Very few of them, but that's what we'll find out with our guys when we get to camp.